Some things that'll need to be done in the near future. Thermostat. Something that they'll need to do in the near future? So sell me a thermostat. So Gene, when, uh, when you have an older style thermostat like that, uh, basically you're not optimizing the uh, effective you didn't see the sign outside the room, did you? No. It says boiler room. Basically, I sell a thermostat on the simplicity of using... So do it. <clears throat> yeah. It's a safe, safe area. <laughs> <laughs> it is. This is what this is for. Iron sharpens iron, brother. Right. Gene, how nice would it be to come home and your home is completely cool before you get there? That's a very good question. I like that question. Mm. I would say just... Uh, <clears throat> ah, 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 ah. We're not throwing him a life ring yet. <laughs> you, you started out really good by asking a question. Okay? Ask me another question. Gene, have you ever gone to your thermostat and wondered why the air conditioner <coughs> still hasn't turned off but you're comfortable in your home? No. But let's say yes. You're, you're about to let me take control of this whole call. So rather than vomiting on me and throwing up information and being all impressed with yourself about it. <laughs> as, and I'm not saying you. I'm saying us collectively as, as people and as technicians. What, is, what do questions do? Questions provoke thought. Questions provoke. Write that down. Questions provoke thought. Wouldn't you like to be able to control what your customer is thinking? Would that be nice? Well, you can do that by leading them with questions. All right? So let's just take that approach. You can take any statement and turn it into a question just by changing the first few words. All right? So write this down. Did you know? Were you aware? Would you believe? Do you suppose? Those are four basics, okay? So you can take those words and put them at the beginning of a statement, and it turns it into a question. All right? So it's a little uh, mind ninja thing. So use that and ask me questions uh, to establish a need for a thermostat. Wi-Fi. Gene, do you, do you suppose that the thermostat that you could have better comfort control out of your thermostat? I suppose. Would you believe that most people are limited in functionality with their thermostat? You better get better than this. All right, you're going to jump in and help them out, Caleb. Are you aware that now when you go to take your uh, thermometer, do you still use mercury? Mm -mm. What do you use? Digital. Oh, you do? So wouldn't you, yeah. wouldn't you think that's going to be a, a better reading of true temperature of the medical field you're using it? Wouldn't you want that same technology in your house? Yeah. Do you get an accurate reading? Do you know why upgrading from a mercury bulb, which could be four to five degrees off in temperature, that's a lot, right? Mm -hmm. What does that mean to you? I don't know. How about money? Every time you turn on that unit, now you got to think, oh my gosh, this mercury bulb thermostat, is this four to five degrees off? I feel good. The thermostat's not turning off. I'm not quite sure. Did you get one? On there that's digital, you have a one degree temperature difference in the home. Now your comfort level is where you want it to be. We can set it for when you wake up, when the kids go to school, when the kids get back home. And the greatest thing is you can operate this from your phone. How easy is that? Mm -hmm. Pretty good, eh? Not bad. Steal that all and sell it back to you next year. <laughs>